It's opening night, Mercedes Benz Fashion Week 2019. How are you guys? We're good. Surprisingly chilled. You seem very chilled. <laughs> For, I mean, you guys have the big opening show. It's very, it's a big honor. How did you feel when you found out that you were going to be opening this year's Mercedes Benz Fashion Week? Uh, we did consider it a huge honour. Like I, th I think it is a big responsibility, and obviously, more than ever, I think we felt compelled to put something on that was truly spectacular. I hope we're doing that. <laughs> yeah, I think every year we all there's always a little bit of pressure and stress, but I think this year in particular we want to make it really special and really memorable. I think hopefully we've done that. So what made you guys pick this location? Um, we really wanted something that was iconically Sydney and as Australia, and also I guess the origins of the brand are very much. Um, you know, a coastal to urban sensibility. And here we are, right, really where land meets sea. Um, so it felt really fitting. Beautiful, beautiful location. I really don't envy these models because this runway is killer. It is so, how long is it? 200 meters, like right round. <laughs> Pretty prints, but very classic age. Oh, always classic age. I think we always have uh, handwriting, um, but definitely, I guess, we're really inspired by rock formations of Australia, so we really wanted to have fun with, you know, exaggerating proportions and adding a lot of volume and drama, um, as well as really accentuating um, our, you know, hand detailing and hand painting and that kind of thing, so craftsmanship. How do we say the name? Oh, yeah, everyone says it differently. It's age for everyone out there, um, but you can say it any way you like. We say as long as somebody's saying it, then that's a good thing. Yeah, it's an acronym. Adrian joins Edwina. Is it? Mm. I didn't know that. No, they, no, I thought no. it was... <laughs> see, I always thought it was short for H, so short for Adrian, H. No, it's it, all... It's us. Yeah. Yeah. So tell me about your favourite look on the runway. Um, there's so many pieces, but I'm particularly in love with the closing look um, and also because of the person that it's on, who I just think is extraordinary. Um, the beautiful Emma Balfour. I think she's just literally ageless, which is a funny thing. Obviously, the brand age, but I think she really defines who we are. Yeah, look, I, I love Emma Balfour. I love the closing dress. There's a couple in there that were inspired by gum nuts, which sounds really weird and kitsch, but they're so beautiful, the colour and the shape, and they're just, they're amazing. I love a gum nut. Is this, is, which one's this from? Because I like this That's one quite nice a lot. That's collection. Yeah. That was actually inspired by the Gold Coast. Yes, Gold Coast. <laughs> Old school Okanui prints is where we kind of got this inspiration from. You guys do a lot of artist collaborations and it off, we often see these like indigenous works and artists on your clothes. Has that always been something that you've wanted to have on your clothes? I think championing artists or artisans in general has always been a big thing. Um, within each of our collections, we always have kind of elements of hand stitching and hand painting. Um, and so I think it just felt like natural to want to collaborate with certain Australian artists in particular. Yeah, it's been an amazing thing to be able to bring art and fashion together. It's something that both Edwina and myself are really passionate about. And it's also bringing it to such a wider group of people um, that art is usually accessible by. So yeah, it's really amazing.